and the United Kingdom High Commission in Ghana has warned terrorists are likely to attack Ghana in an updated travel advice to UK nationals and those planning to visit the country. The warning comes after terrorist attack in Ghana's neighboring countries, Ivory Coast and Burkina Faso. The United Kingdom High Commission in Ghana in this travel advice urged citizens to remain vigilant, exercise caution and follow the advice of local authorities. The travel advice said terrorists are likely to try to carry out attacks in Ghana, which could be indiscriminate, including places visited by foreigners. An estimated 80,000 UK nationals visit Ghana every year, with Ghana being one of the UK's major trading partners in Africa. The Canadian government last week also alerted its nationals traveling to Ghana or in Ghana after two Canadians were kidnapped in Kumasi in the Ashanti region. The statement asked Canadian nationals to be aware of their surroundings and avoid walking alone or displaying signs of wealth. It also urged its nationals to ensure that windows and doors in their residences are secured. Two suspected terrorists from Burkina Faso have been arrested in the Upper West Region. One stormed the Roman Catholic Church at Hamley armed with a fully loaded pistol but was busted after two persons became suspicious about him and alerted the police. The other suspect was arrested after he crossed the border illegally to buy alcohol last Wednesday. Terrorists with links to Islamic State are active in Burkina Faso and Mali and the General Sahel area. The terrorists have attacked churches and also killed security forces. In March 2016, militants killed at least 16 people in a gun attack on a beach resort in southern Ivory Coast. The attackers fired on beach goers in Grand Bassam, about 40 kilometers from the commercial capital Abidjan. Four of the dead were Westerners. Al-Qaeda in the Islamic Maghrib said it launched the attack.